Russia, a land of vast plains, icy tundra, and deep forests. This immense country stretches across Europe and Asia, encompassing a diverse range of landscapes and climates. For centuries it was ruled by powerful czars. These monarchs wielded immense power and influence, shaping the destiny of the nation. These rulers emerged from the tumultuous period following the Mongol invasions. The Mongol rule left a lasting impact on the region, influencing its culture and political structure. A young prince named Ivan, later known as Ivan the Great, rose to prominence. His leadership and vision were instrumental in transforming Russia. He challenged Mongol authority and declared himself Tsar. This bold move marked a significant turning point in Russian history. This marked the beginning of a centralized Russian state. Under Ivan's rule, the foundations of a unified nation were laid. Ivan the Great's successors continued to expand their territory. They pushed the boundaries of the state, incorporating new lands and peoples. They pushed eastwards, conquering new lands and solidifying their power. This expansion was crucial in establishing Russia as a formidable empire. The Tsars ruled with absolute authority. Their word was law. Their centralized control allowed them to maintain order and enforce their will across the vast territories. They commanded a vast army and controlled the country's wealth. The military might and economic resources at their disposal were unparalleled. This period saw the construction of iconic landmarks like St. Basil's Cathedral, a testament to the Tsar's growing power. These architectural marvels symbolized the grandeur and ambition of the Russian state. Life under the early Tsars was a mix of grandeur and hardship. While the elite enjoyed luxury, the common people faced numerous challenges. The Tsars lived in opulent palaces and held lavish courts, their extravagant lifestyles were a stark contrast to the lives of ordinary Russians. However, the majority of Russians were peasants, toiling the land to support the Tsarist regime. Their labor was the backbone of the economy, yet they lived in relative poverty. Despite the stark social divide, Russia was emerging as a major force on the world stage. Its influence and power were growing, setting the stage for its future as a global superpower. As Russia grew, so did its ambitions, reaching far beyond its original borders. Peter the Great, one of Russia's most transformative czars, recognized the urgent need for modernization to compete with Western powers. He traveled extensively to Western Europe, immersing himself in the study of shipbuilding, navigation, and effective governance. Inspired by his travels and the advancements he witnessed, Peter implemented sweeping reforms upon his return to Russia. He modernized the army, built a powerful navy, and founded the city of St. Petersburg, which he envisioned as Russia's window to the West. Peter's reforms were transformative, turning Russia into a major European power with significant influence. The construction of St. Petersburg, a magnificent new capital city, symbolized Russia's newfound status and ambition. The empire continued to expand further, stretching from the Baltic Sea in the West to the vast Pacific Ocean in the East. Russia was no longer an isolated land, but had become a major player in European politics and warfare, influencing events far beyond its borders. Catherine the Great, another influential ruler, continued Peter's ambitious legacy of expansion and modernization. She focused on education, culture, and the arts, earning the moniker Catherine the Enlightened for her contributions to Russian society. Under her rule, Russia absorbed even more territory and further strengthened its position as a European powerhouse. However, despite the significant progress and modernization, the vast majority of Russians remained untouched by these advancements, living in poverty and servitude, highlighting the stark contrasts within the empire. The Romanov dynasty, which began in 1613, would rule Russia for three centuries, shaping the nation's destiny through times of both prosperity and peril. This period witnessed both Russia's zenith, with its vast territorial expansions and cultural achievements, and its descent into chaos and revolution. The early Romanovs consolidated power, expanding the empire further east and engaging in wars with neighboring powers, solidifying their control over a vast and diverse land. However, beneath the surface of imperial grandeur, social tensions simmered as the lives of ordinary Russians were marked by hardship and inequality. The vast disparity between the wealthy elite and the impoverished masses grew wider, creating a society divided by class and privilege. The reign of Tsar Nicholas II, the last Romanov ruler, marked a turning point in the dynasty's history. Nicholas was a deeply conservative ruler, resistant to change in a rapidly modernizing world, and his inability to adapt would prove disastrous. 
His autocratic rule, coupled with Russia's disastrous involvement in World War I, fueled widespread discontent among the populace. The war devastated the Russian economy, leading to severe shortages and suffering, and exposed the Tsar's inadequacies as a leader. Russia's defeat in the Russo-Japanese War and the Bloody Sunday Massacre, where peaceful protesters were gunned down by Tsarist troops, further eroded the people's trust in the monarchy, setting the stage for unrest. The stage was set for a revolution that would forever alter the course of Russian history, leading to the fall of the Romanov dynasty and the rise of a new political order. By 1917 Russia was a powder keg of discontent and unrest, the Tsar's authority had crumbled, and the country was racked by war, famine, and economic collapse. In February 1917, a spontaneous uprising in Petrograd, sparked by bread shortages and deplorable working conditions, ignited the revolution. The Tsar, facing insurmountable pressure, abdicated, ending centuries of Romanov rule. A provisional government composed of liberal and moderate socialist leaders attempted to establish a democratic system. However, they were quickly overshadowed by the Bolsheviks, a radical socialist faction led by Vladimir Lenin. Lenin, a charismatic and ruthless revolutionary, promised peace, land, and bread to the war-weary and impoverished masses. In October 1917, the Bolsheviks led by Lenin and Leon Trotsky staged a coup d'etat. They overthrew the provisional government and seized control of the entire country. The October Revolution as it came to be known marked the beginning of the Soviet Union, a communist state that would dominate the 20th century.